Hello everyone, I am Joya and today we are making braised American lamb shake with anchovy and rosemary white beans. Here I have two beautiful lamb shanks. I'm gonna season these shanks well with salt and pepper. This is a big cut of meat, so don't be afraid to season. Let's get these in the pan searing. Oh yeah, hear that sizzle? Now that they're in the pan, I'll go ahead and season the other side with salt and pepper as well. While these are browning up, I'm gonna go ahead and jump over to our anchovy and rosemary vinaigrette. I have anchovies here. We're gonna use six anchovies. Give it a nice little chop. We'll add those to the bowl. I'm going to add a tablespoon of Dijon mustard. One clove of garlic. I'm gonna give a quick mince. I'm gonna mince a little bit of rosemary. A quarter cup of red wine vinegar. I'll give that a nice little whisk. We're gonna add the zest and juice of a lemon. This lemon's pretty large, so I'll probably only use about half of it. And then I'm gonna whisk in about a half a cup of olive oil. And I'm gonna set this aside to use later. Let's check on those shanks. See that color? That's what we're looking for, really nice deep brown. I'm gonna give them a little turn and then just let that searing process continue. And then now I'm gonna start kind of building the flavors behind our braising liquid. I'm gonna start with an onion. We're gonna give this onion a nice dice. This time I'm also gonna mince up three cloves of garlic. Taking a look at these shanks now, I think our color and our sear is there. So we're gonna get these out of the pot, let them rest here for a moment while we build our braising liquid. Drop in that onion we dice. I'm also gonna add in the minced garlic. Our onions are looking nice and cooked. They have a little color and are beginning to appear translucent. So I'm gonna deglaze this pan with about a cup of white wine. It's kind of reduced down and deglazed the bottom of the pan. And so we're gonna to add to that two cups of broth. You can use beef broth, chicken broth, but ideally you would really use that homemade lamb broth if you had it. We'll add our nice seared shanks back into the pot. I'm also gonna put in with that two sprigs of rosemary and two bay leaves. Let's take a little bit of that vinaigrette we made earlier with the anchovies, and we're just gonna take a small amount of it and kind of brush it or spoon it right over these shanks to give them extra flavor while they begin their braise. So I'm gonna pop the lid on these and throw them in the oven at 325 degrees for about two hours. Let's go check on those lamb shanks in the oven. I took a look at them, put a little more of the vinaigrette on top and then put them back in for another hour. So these braised for about three hours total. And look at these shanks, they have gotten so tender. I am going to add two cans of white beans, the remaining of our vinaigrette, and I'm just gonna chop up a little extra rosemary to give it a little extra brightness. I'm gonna go back in the oven uncovered for just about 30 minutes, just to kind of warm those beans through and let them absorb some of that liquid. Our beans have warmed through, so let's platter this up. Look at this beautiful American lamb shank. Amazing, so tender. And then we'll just spoon all of this gorgeous liquid and our beans, that anchovy vinaigrette. I'm gonna garnish this with just a few lemon wedges, a little bit of fresh parsley, and there you have it. Braised American lamb shank with anchovy and rosemary white beans.